Hello guys, hi, welcome to my vlog, again this is Kat, and I mainly make some videos about the Ants Underground Kingdom gameplay tips and tricks. Now in this video, I'm going to share to you what is currently happening in server 15 with their War of Kings. So yes, today is Saturday, that means... Um, there will be a specific alliance who's going to hold the tree, but one alliance in server 15 um, gave the chance to everyone to fight for the tree. But of course, there are some specific rules that they had made in order to have a friendly war against other alliances. So again, this is server 15, okay? I'm not sure what your server is doing every um, Saturday but this is just for today i'm not sure if also they're going to repeat it but this is just like an example of how to battle with a tree using a specific tier of troops now let me try to show you what are the rules that they have implemented to this event so here i'm going to go to my notes and show you what they actually said so this saturday no one is opening up the war of kings to all alliances yes you heard that right every player is invited to come and fight the war on tree whether you are in your main alliance or farm alliance it doesn't matter if your farms are strong enough they can be crowned king for the week but but there are some caveats Number one, you can only fight when you are inside the land of abundance. Any hits from the outside will be countered. Yes, that's a very clear. So if you can see, all those who are fighting for the tree are around it. See? Right. So if you wanted to fight for the tree, you just need to go to the... LOA or Land of Abundance. So what is Land of Abundance? If you can see this dark green part, this is what we call the Land of Abundance. It is where the tree is and also the squirters. So this is a tree. It's still designed as a Christmas tree. And these are the squirters. We have four squirters, north, east, south, and west. Okay, so that is the rule number one. And we have the rule number two. You can only use tier one troops. Your choice of guardians, shooters, carriers, or a mix of those. As long as they are T ones, you are golden. Yeah, so they are very strict for that rule. So I actually joined um my troops and I used Oh gosh, I used um, shooter, T1 shooters. If you can see, I had some, yeah, dead ants because I was attacked by some squirters in here. I can show you the battle report. <laughs> so it was like this. Yeah, so once you occupied or successfully occupied your troops in the tree and the squirters are being occupied by other alliances then the squirters are going to hit you but if you also occupied the squirters and then you are safe so that's just it if you can see the Occupying Alliance is TWP, and here we have ABC, so that means this squirter is going to hit what's inside, or yeah, who are those inside the tree, alright? So again, strictly um, said that you can only use Tier 1 troops, okay, no T98, and so on and so forth. Are allowed just t1 and let's try to continue with the rule number three you can use your insects start up specials no specials at all the choice is entirely up to you 
We just want an equal playing field, so we will only allow T1s, which means any player in the server can participate. Correct? So, um, if you have um, 11 um, insect, 11 star insect, or uh, any level or star insect, it's okay. As long as your troops are tier 1. And then we have fourth, any player are not playing in accordance with rules 1 and 2 will be zeroed and banned from participation. Yes, just to be fair so that not everyone can violate the rule. Right? So if you actually did not follow rule 1 and rule 2, then maybe the other players will attack you because you did not follow the rule and you took advantage of everyone so yeah must follow the rule everyone now we have number five whichever alliance controls tree the longest becomes king by the end of the day aside from that normal buff distribution rules apply however if your alliance was already in the top six that means you will have extra buffs to distribute to your own team or others. That's up to you. Heavy is the herd that wears the crown. Let's have some fun this Saturday, play fair, and may the best T1 unit win. Oh, okay. So that's it. That is what the no one or this alliance had um, made up for the rule in this day. So again, let me try to show you something. Oh, I need to disconnect again. <laughs> so let me try to reload. Yes, so actually, I don't really have anything to say for this. I am respecting what this alliance had um, offered for their chance. So maybe they are trying to show or to try to give it a go. Um, because lately, server 15 is having a conflict, um, with the tree rotational list. Maybe some sides are suggesting something and the other side is not agreeing at all. But since they, it's their turn... And they tried to suggest this and open this to all the alliances then I don't have any problem with it at all so you see it's already happening and I don't see any problem maybe there's a delay of the time so yeah that is the only thing that I can see and since it's T1 it's not much that costly healing the troops since yeah it's just tier one so the only thing that i can say maybe the negative part of this event is that it will take much time since time check it's already 307 p.m philippine time since i'm from the philippines and if one alliance uh, occupied this and no one fought at all then at four or five in the afternoon they had successfully occupied a tree but since they opened and um let everyone contest the tree then yeah it will take time since if you can see it's still 35 percent as of now so yeah this is just you know an example of a way on how you can contest a tree without um causing any damage or any disadvantage at all so yep i just wanted to share how s15 is going on with their war of kings so I'm not sure if other alliances is going to apply this for the next War of Kings. So yes, peace y'all. And I just hope you can find it entertaining. 
and yeah i just wanted to share really <laughs> all right so i'm just going to end the video now and i can try to fight for the tree along with my allies twp so thank you so much for watching this video and i hope you can support more to me on making videos about dance thank you so much guys goodbye